This is my Reclaimer 18. Its loadout is devastating for zombies. You should give it a try at once. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Ghost X and here's another video of the channel. Let's roll the clip. The best combination for this gun is Flawless Crystal, obviously, and you put Legendary Tool, I'll put the Napalm Ammo Mod and also this Shot Daiquiri. And of course, we'll add Mega Folding. I also have blade and golden armor, so let's go ahead and put those on. And I think we are ready for bounties. Let's see what we have. So we got one over here. Let's go ahead and get that started. Okay. All right. Let's see where we get as a first bounty. And of course, it's a mega. I mean, hundred percent. Most of the time, first bounty, I get a mega. All right, buddy, let's go ahead and get started. How about that? Yeah, let's try this gun on you. You can see, like, there's a, that health bar just went down with a couple shots. And it's amazing. I can't get enough of this gun, to be honest with you. And the reason I'm jumping with the Scorcher is just to trigger the Mega 2 laser. Here you go. Okay, I guess we can do one more jumping or scorching. Yeah, I think one more laser for this guy. All right, let's do it. And almost, there you go. All right, that's it. I mean, what is it? Um, 10 seconds, 15? I gotta calculate this. And let's see what we got in the rift. We got two survives. I'll take that, and I'll take the mortar strike as well. Okay, I think we can go and get some perks let's see what we get i'll get this 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 and that i'll skip the um not the phd flubber the elemental pop can because i really want to keep the napalm um feature on this gun okay so the next thing i wanted to do is to go to the storm caller and because in my opinion any gun that you try on a storm caller and it it beats it fast that means that gun i mean it's gonna work on any boss in the game in my opinion the storm caller is the hardest boss um at least in uh you know taking into consideration tier one through tier three uh, i wouldn't consider dark either part of this statement but there you go, we got it in probably less than 30 seconds, guys. This is awesome, I'll take that skull. All right, and then time for the next bounty. Let's come over here. What's that, is that a box over there? Probably upstairs. Get this money over here. And we got another mega. All right. Let's head over there. Here we go, it's already lasering. Look at that health bar. Just almost went down to the third. Went down a third. If only these zombies let me just shoot them again in peace. I would really be appreciative. Zombies, leave me alone. God. I think I gotta be on a higher spot because there's too many of them over here. There you go. There you go. All right. I almost got him. It's a little bit um, further range for the shotgun, but I think it's gonna work. And boom, we got him. This didn't take long as well. Let's see how much we got. I'll take that sentry gun and zombies just leave me alone, please. All right, time for the next one. We got one just right there. Okay, what do we got? Another mega? No, it's the mangler. <laughs> okay, poor mangler. This is gonna be nothing. Boom. For a second, I thought that mangler was the HVT, but no, I was mistaken. The real HVT is right here. Okay. Oh man. I think that was less than 20 seconds, guys. I can't really talk enough about how strong this gun is. It's just ridiculously awesome, to be honest with you. Alrighty. So, this is another Mega in basically the same spot. 
but oh my god look at that firepower it's just ridiculous ridiculous except that i'm about to die by the zombies over here i just i gotta do something to make it um laser but let me see there we go i mean if i shoot that mouth if it's you know if it's open and you shoot it it's the same almost the same effect as when the mega lasers there you go boom gone okay at this point i think i should be okay to go to the dark ether i'm gonna buy some casmir's here i think i want to go to the second dark ether Okay, I think 2,000 only left, which is, that's fine. I mean, I have enough Casmir's I might, ha I think I bought six just now. Activating Dark Aether here to go to regular sigil does not need a sigil anymore. I think you all know this, but I'm not sure why they still show uh, the regular sigil in their war drifts. Okay, this is going to be a piece of cake. Let's go ahead and get the first contract started. And you're going to come over here. If you haven't noticed my operator, it's the entity. <laughs> Just FYI. Okay. And actually, it's a mangler today. It's not mega. Okay, here is the entity going to fight that mangler in the dark ether. Ain't that crazy? <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh boy, look at that. He's gonna he's gonna drop. This is probably like six seconds, guys. This is awesome, and I get mega folding and. Uh, I think I got a self revive as well. And let's try it on the second contract. Here, basically, I know this is a regular uh, Dark Ether, but I mean, this gun is just superior to pretty much any single shot or single fire rate uh, gun. Okay, and I got another mag of holding, and now up to the third contract. Here we go, picked it up, let's go. I think I'm gonna go to the last one over there, the extractor, and then make my way to the first one so I can, you know, kinda get closer to the exfil. Okay, let me go ahead and use one of these Casmir's and maybe get rid of this disciple here. Sometimes interacting or activating these contracts or basically Anything needs interaction in Modern Warfare 3 Zombies is a bit glitched out. I know a lot of people complain about it, but if you try it, you know, a couple of times, it will work. And I think, in my opinion, the best way to prevent this from happening is to change your settings to hold to activate. And I think that would work almost 100% of the time. Okay, guys, you can clearly see the effectiveness of this shotgun and how you can basically dominate anything, whether in Tier 3 or Dark Aether. I know I haven't gone to the Elder Dark Aether, but this weapon will still be a few shot kill weapon. Here is the loadout for you, and in my opinion, this is one of the top one or two most OP loadouts in this game. Finally, I just hope you guys enjoyed the video and found it useful for your gaming. Let me know in the comments if you have different opinion or better loadout of this gun. I appreciate all likes and subscribing to the channel and to all people in the country who are currently affected by thunderstorms or hurricanes. I want to say stay safe and God bless. See you all in the next one. Cheers.